One eWeb customer is fed up with the utility company's efforts to install smart electric meters across their entire system. A move the utility says will improve service delivery and meet evolving industry standards. KEZI 9 News reporter Albert James shows us why one person wants to keep their current meter and how eWeb is pushing along with the change. This is the analog meter. It is safe. It is perfectly functional. There is uh, no, um, no problem with this meter at all. Dennis Herner is staunchly against having a smart meter installed on his Amazon area home. eWeb says since 2018, they've installed the new meters on 80% of homes they service, but Herner has made it clear he doesn't want any part of it due to health, privacy, and other concerns. And the threat is if I don't disconnect, if, if I don't accept a smart meter, they will cut off my service. An eWeb spokesperson says the technology meets their high safety and security standards and customers have the choice to get a smart meter with communication features turned off, operating, quote, essentially like a traditional meter. Herner has also taken issue with how an eWeb employee and two security guards he was unaware of recently approached him about installing a smart meter. This is outrageous behavior. It is, not, it is irresponsible behavior for a public utility to treat a customer with no direct reason to, to treat me that way. Why? EWIB says they've had security with their staff on these visits due to threats and only the meter tech approaches the door so people don't feel ganged up on. Herner says it's critical eWeb, as a public utility, offer the public the choice of whether or not they have smart meters installed on their homes. Why does it have to be 100% installation uh, in, in this community? Why do they do that? If they are serving us, give us a choice. eWeb says they're modernizing infrastructure to improve their services, and they're acting within their policies and conditions of service to install these meters. Herner says he just wants to keep his existing meter. It's my house, it's my bedroom where that smart meter is going to be located. And I, as a citizen of Eugene, being served by eWeb, I want to be able to have a choice when there is available technology. I'm not saying do something you can't do, it doesn't exist. It exists right now on my wall. There's an analog meter there. And that's all. That's, it's that simple. Reporting in Eugene, Albert James, KEZI 9 News.